the march that took place, okay? So we see all the marches ha happening city after city. Yeah, yeah. Now we see it in Bridgeport. And you're the figurehead that we see. <laughs> How did I'm you six get, five. And, and, I mean, you, you can catch me over anything. The, the, the image of the blowhorn right there, yeah, the black yeah, and yeah, white yeah. photo. That's what I remember right there. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, my so, mega horn. That's, yes. my, that's, that's my new uh, my new gun, man. I'm a oh, felon. I don't okay. carry guns no more, so that's my new weapon. Like that. So talk about that. How did you get into that position? What was it? Do you think that what happened in Milford and all of the other kind of uh, things that you've gone through? Oh, yeah, that nah, definitely just... was a trauma from everything. Like, I, I definitely was on go, like, because it was, it was fresh. Like I said, mine's happened... I don't remember if it was a Sunday or Monday that Floyd got killed like like three days later. Yeah. So, you know, I'm taking energy for Floyd too because that's where every, most of everybody else was. Yeah. But inside, personally, I'm like, yo, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just went through this 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 type of uh, brutality. Right. So, um, that, that like, I, like the whole thing uh, organized downtown at the Green uh, with, with, with some young, uh, some uh, sisters of mine that, that do their thing. Uh, I think it's 100... 100 Girls, honey, salute Bobby and, 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 and Jen and all of them. I think I know what you're talking about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. They, they little thing they had organized. Yeah. But while we was there, me and a, and a few uh, soldiers was all talking. And uh, we like, like, and, and a few, you know, sisters and, and, and salute to Jazz uh, and, you know, the whole Justin for Jason. Yeah. We just was like, yo, we gonna bring this to the to the police station. A lot of people ain't wanna wanna rock with us, but we like, man, whatever. Like the time is now. Like we fed up. Like we like they said, we tired of being tired. Like we we you know we 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 uh begged for years. Exactly. We've been begging. We've been begging. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? Then then then, then we start uh, uh slowly approaching, but now we run it. Like we run it. We run it. We, we used to run away. Mm -hmm. Now we be running towards it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Towards the static. Yeah. Even if, you know, it's, it, it's casualty of war, some people get arrested, some, you know, whatever, riots break out, whatever. But we we not we not running away no more. We running towards it. So we went to the police station, uh, a, a, a bunch of soldiers, female uh, men, you know what I'm saying? And, and, and we try to put pressure on, on the former chief. As we know, he just got arrested. We, we try to, you know, put pressure to get him to talk about What's going on in Bridgeport? Yeah, yeah. About about Jason and about you know what yeah, I'm saying what's going on. Yeah. And you guys camp camped out for days. Oh yeah 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 seven I days. Did, oh my goodness. Everybody that camped out. Oh no, I saw all of that. Y'all even brought that mantra to the highway, shut it down. Oh yeah yeah, yeah yeah that was yeah the, the highway was the that that first what's going day. On? What's going on? You want to go on station. live? Okay. Um, cause it, what what uh I got made made by the police. Huh? Oh, yeah, God. and then and then we everybody well we walked all the way okay walked no all problem the way, like to East I see. and then came back and jumped on the highway okay. and 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 set it off there that was the first in the state then after that you all know, right hold on hold, hold on hold on I'm gonna put you on live all right right okay hold on awesome. hold on that that definitely just set a different tone and I'm so happy that you know people were inspired to to follow through and to also be selfless enough to support what this cause means. Like you said, former chief of police, former. Y'all definitely applied pressure. Yeah, yeah. And we've been saying, like, yo, he, he crooked. Yeah, oh, no. That's why you're wanna... about to lose your job. <laughs> I don't, don't want to interrupt y'all real quick. I, yeah. I apologize, but we got a caller. Caller, caller, what's up, man? You said you got a question for Joe Grinch. Can you load that down in the background, please? Mm -hmm. Yes, caller. You on live yeah, right yes, now. Yes, yes. I'm on live. Okay. I wanted to ask Joe something, like, what do you say about that situation on the highway? Ain't that telling? Say it again. Say it again. Come on. Him telling him telling the story. Well, about the situation on the highway. Nah, it, you know, you know why it's not? But before you, get, it, it was recorded. It, 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 it was documented. I'm not saying nothing different than what you could go on YouTube right now, and, it, and it's the same, the same situation. That, that was a good one, though. I I, I hear you. Yeah. <laughs> I hear you. No, yeah. I hear you. I I I ain't, um. I, it, it's no um. What they call it? Statements and like that. that. That's documented. I can't. If I if I would have died that way, if I would have died that day, it would have been. You know what I'm saying? If I'm not going to jail, because you tell me that story or you see it on the record. What what from the the you talking about from me getting arrested, right? Yeah, because I'm doing what they did to do. Yeah. Huh? What do you say? Say it again? Uh, but then, the recording of what they did to you, not, that's how I go to jail. Now, what, what, you know I got, 
let me I, I I explain two ways as far as with my car. So I got um my joint got got sprayed up one uh about a year ago, right? So I put um video cameras in my car. Everybody know that. Like I, I I'm not no president or nothing like that, but I do move. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm a public figure. You know what I'm saying? I'm not the average Joe just walking down the street. You know what I'm saying? I gotta you protect definitely gotta myself. Protect yourself. Yeah, 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 yeah. And I'm a felon, so I can't move how how I really want to move. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I had I I got the same uh like the the front and back mirror joints and it, and it, it and it's it's video cameras. So that whole thing with the um with the boys when they pull me over, all that's all that's on camera. You know what I'm saying? I gotta protect myself. It's it's sad that it, I'm saying I'm protecting myself against the the, the, the the law or whatever, anything that I'm able to, whether I'm here or not, somebody, my family, you know what I'm saying? Somebody could be like, yo, boom. You and know what I mean? And so, it's a good thing that, you know, that you, you do, I mean, it's sad that you do have to protect yourself like that, but it's also a good thing because now you have witnesses. Yeah. That's maybe not in a physical form, but yeah, no, it's yeah, documented. Yeah. And, you got it's a it's a day. different time and once again like when it when it when it when it come to this like especially when it's uh, not me versus another man or, or whatever but when it comes to versus a citizen in the law they always got the upper hand. That's a fact. So in this situation if nothing was on Facebook live if I ain't say yo my people's I'm at exit 30 whatever I would have just probably got my I maybe would have died. It may, yeah. Maybe, matter of fact, I probably would have died. You know why? Because the fact that I had the phone makes them less aggressive. Yeah, that's true. You know what I'm saying? Now, y'all heard the, and whoever watched it, y'all see, I was talking my sh you know what I'm saying? So I know they would have, they would have really tore me up. And I, if everybody know that's me anyway, it ain't like I was fronting for the camera. No, exactly. I'm, I'm a loud dude. No. <laughs> Anything else, Carla? Anything else? Nah, uh, I'm good with All right, appreciate it, man. Thank you for calling in. Yeah, so once again, man, we got Joe Brits in the building. We're going to take a quick break, you know what I mean, and, and um, revisit everything. Um, people, I, I appreciate you calling in and, and listening because, like I said, man, this this is basically something serious, and it's it's on a day-to-day -day basis, you know what I mean, as, as black individuals, as black mothers, black fathers, you know, we, we have to walk through some of these streets sometimes and um, be afraid, you know what I mean, and, and not be afraid of others. Now we're being afraid of the law, <laughs> you know, and, and that's not right. That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's, it's not cool at all. You know, it's not right because at the end of the day, they they are to protect and serve. That's what they're sworn in to do. You know, they, they are sworn in to protect and serve their city, their people, you know, their town, you know, and at this point in time, they're not even doing that. They're not, you know, they're, they're basically blatantly just disrespecting us. And shooting at us, shooting us. Oh, no, they're, they're you know, they're organized gang. They're getting away with it. it. It's definitely getting away with it. You know, because I once, I once heard Grit say, um, the Blue Coats is a gang. Yeah, okay. that, that's biggest, a gang in itself. The biggest gang in America, oh, man. Oh my God, there was a, a on Gangland. A couple of them got busted in L.A. Yeah, nah, they're the biggest gang in America, oh, man. Yeah. So they, we, they, we, you know, whether you a blood crip, the uh, solid. Uh, Whatever, brotherhood nation, but it's nothing like them. Exactly. So, <laughs> so before we get into these commercials, right? So, Grace, I want to talk about real quick. Yeah. I want to talk about this, this, this walk that you did on the bridge. How did you accomplish that? That was something that went worldwide. Well, um, I, I, you know, as far as Connecticut go, I, I definitely take the, 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 um, the leadership in that. You know what I'm saying? But when I was in Atlanta in 2015, I forgot who got killed then. So many people, the police killed so many people, but it was the dude that was trying to sell his, his CDs. He was selling his mixtapes. Um, I forgot his name, but the dude was selling his uh, mixtapes or whatever, and he got killed by the police. Um, I was in Atlanta, um, and they, they took over the highway. I was with them. Um, it was like T.I., the rapper, was up there with us, Killer Mike. I seen that one. Yeah, I, yeah. I was, you I, also took a black and white picture. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, seen yeah, that yeah, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I don't just do this when it's... I, everywhere I go, I'm, 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 on, I'm on the front line. But, you know, so I kind of got it from there. And then uh, it wasn't the beat, the bait that day in Bridgeport because, you know, somebody else saying they, it was their idea and all that. But when you go back to the live cameras... 
you hear me and I think it was uh, my uh, my brother Ant or somebody else, you just hear me saying, yo, F it, let's just let's take over the highway. And, and, I and, watch and, and it's a it. picture. I yeah. watch what you said. It. But the big thing, uh, I forgot who um, tagged me in a picture. Somebody took a picture of me running towards the highway first. You see me ahead of the whole pack. Yes. You definitely was. Like, and, and that, that, like, I ain't, I ain't tell them to take that picture. That was just somebody <laughs> in their with. So, you know, it's going to be forever. They gonna, people going to have what they say on that. But, you know, I know at the end of the day, um, Bridgeport as a whole, we definitely led that. And then, you know, it just spent around the whole state. Uh, salute uh, Los Fidel, another soldier that that, that been... Um, you know, pushing it like I, I was with him in East Haven. Um, salute everybody in Hartford. I know they did it. Waterbury, that joint looked it wild too. And then you know, we uh, I took it down to Norwalk and uh, Jalen Seed and, and a few uh, uh, other brothers out that way. We, we did it again. Also, um, it was it was something that I seen um, as you as you guys were doing um, your 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 uh, marches and all of that. It was an incident with one of the leaders that you were with. And he ended up getting hit or something like that by another uh, rider. It, it was somewhere you went. Oh, oh, that is wow. That's what I was just talking about. So, uh, Lowe's. Yeah, uh, and he, 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 he ended up getting right hit. Now. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. He, so, what happened was um, that was with the whole Cummins um, statue situation. Um, and, yes, and, and, yes, and, and yes. Lowe's is in Facebook jail, and I'm pretty sure he'll catch <laughs> him, view this. But salute Lowe's because he. I, he even like he he liked the little brother like you feel me he always say I, yo, grits grits the one that you know inspired me to do because when I go to these places when I pop up in Waterbury pop up in New Haven I'll be riding by myself now you know uh, salute uh, Vy and a few other uh, brothers that I rock with you know I hit them up now because they you know we they, they they don't want me to just go out there and get killed or whatever so now we kind of unionize it and move move more strategic. I was moving everywhere, just riding around by myself. And and that's how Los was. Like, Los went out there that morning by himself, um, trying to uh, save another brother. And, you know, them... them uh, they uh, end up jumping on him. Yeah, they end up jumping on him and uh, hit, hitting him. Well, he hit... He, I, I guess he... Uh, well, it's all on. It's all yeah, on. Yeah, it was. It, it was. It was, it was all, all on footage. footage. You know I seen the whole footage, but yeah, yeah. he, you know, the guy ended up, you know, very disrespectful. You know, hit him and whatever the case may be. No cops was called. Yeah, and, that, and see, no cops was called. That, that was that, that's, that was more to me more more white privilege. You know what I'm saying? Because wow. uh, then when they put it in the paper, once again, this all on footage. It's, it's not like we just we speaking on something that ain't you know we're, it's, it's statewide news now, but. Um, in the paper, they made it seem like Los was the aggressor, and he was by himself. He was definitely by himself. <laughs> so oh, definitely, yeah. But yeah, so yeah, so we go through that. But when we was in East Haven, he got he got hit by a car. You know what I'm saying? And I, I, I you know, I was with him for that too. So you know, we we, we go through a lot. Um, you know, uh, By him and uh, uh, another soldier, Kurt, was in West Haven, and uh, they they end up getting arrested, thrown all around, and. You know, everywhere we go, we risk ourselves. That's another thing. Like, yeah. people think it's clout chasing. People got so much to say. I don't think it's one person right now, especially somebody like me who got two kids, that wake up in the morning and say, I want to go to jail. I want to do something just stupid and go to jail. You know what I'm saying? I always tell people, I'll go to jail righteously, but I won't go foolishly. So I don't just do stupid stuff. Yeah. But if I go and I'm, and I'm, and I'm, and I'm protesting for our, our, our rights and, you know, I end up getting a... Uh, uh, disturbance charge or whatever, then I take that. But um, everything I do is for a reason. Like we don't, we 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 strategize and, 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 and real strategic. We got the, the the bail fund. Like we got people that put the money to the side so we can get out. Like it's, you know, this is this ain't. A so like I said before, we get up out here. I want to talk about this song real quick, and it's called Blessings. Okay. What made you make this song? Because I'm gonna play it before we go to commercial. But it's called Blessings. What made you make this song? And what what the title of it? I right, so so blessings, I mean salute, salute to Great A. Great A on the song. Um, like I said, unfortunately he passed two two months after I got home, so we wasn't able to record no no new music. But um he, he, he recorded so much that, that he wasn't able to release. So uh, salute Rick Dada, um uh, he a producer and, and a and a barber that, that came out of uh, uh South North, uh and he a rapper as well. Um he produced the beat because he was he was a great A's engineer. So he he now nobody has heard 
new material from grade A in, in 12 years. You know what I'm saying? But uh, he blessed me. He knew he knew what, what grade A meant to me. Um, he blessed me with the record. Um, uh, that's grade A rapping over the uh, um, the beat. He had tuned it with it with it like that, and I jumped on it and spit my two verses. But the way it's called blessings is because uh, grade A last last word in the song is blessings. So I, I I just you know created the hook and the verse off of what I I heard him saying, and um, I I, I want to you know give it out to his son because you know real 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 G's do real things so. Um, I put the song, it's on iTunes, it's on all platforms, Apple, Tidal. I want y'all, if y'all don't support me at all, y'all don't got to listen to none of my music, y'all don't got to watch my, my Facebook joints or nothing, but but stream that song, because what I did, Grade A uh, died prematurely. He wasn't able to see this wave of music and make money off of music like I'm doing right now. So I registered his name and put it through his son. So his son is getting paid from that song. His son was uh, one year, almost two years old when he passed. So he don't know his dad like I knew his dad, you know what I'm saying? Which we always speak, salute uh, Ty. That's the little nephew, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, he even was happy, you know what I'm saying? So his, his son, in three months, will be getting him a, 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 a BMI a, a check, you know what I'm saying? From his dad. So, you know, that's something that I wouldn't do. A lot of people got homies and stuff that passed away and they just let it just go. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I can't, I can't, I can't go a month without talking to Grady Mom or visiting or, or checking his older, um, his younger brother and and as soon as other brother owe me um, touching money. Like I gotta tap in with these people because my 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 G loved me and I feel like he died for our block. So I gotta, you know, carry that weight for him. And um, yeah, like I said, man, stream that song, Joe Grits, uh, featuring Grade A. It's called Blessings, man. Stream that.